host is me, Kitty Saki Jackie, and welcome back to my little sister. Or my big sister. God damn it, my big sister, not my little sister. I made a mistake on the last episode. Oh, Jesus Christ, cat. God damn it. <laughs> my, my cat just opened my door and then I got scared by the door opening. Anyway. I made a mistake on the last episode that, like, I completely skipped what the sister was going to tell me. So, I I didn't, I don't have a footage because I have no idea what she said as well. So, we're just starting here. There's some sort of metal cable floating in the water. I could fish it out if I had a fishing pole. Well, does it look like I have a fishing pole? Bye, kitty cat! Jesus Christ, man, you scared the shit out of me. This must be the way out of here. But it's locked. I'll have to find a key. Alright, seems fair enough. But why can't I just not go to the water? What is this? I could use this, this wood to make a bridge. It looks old, though. I just hope it doesn't break. Is it going to break? It looks like it's going to break. Oh, there's other things. Hey, there's something shiny in there. But I ain't sticking my hand in there. I need to find a way to reach it. Like, do I still have the stuff that I had in the last episode? No, I just have wood. I thought I would have my chopsticks with me. Fine. I can see something glimmer in there. But I ain't sticking my hand in there. I need something long to reach it. Okay, so it seems like I can only work with the stuff that I get from the chapter that I'm in. Alright, alright, fair enough. I hope this holds. I don't want to get wet again. I think it's going to hold. Yeah, it's see, it holds pretty well. Alright, let's go in here. Ooh, hmm. There must be a key in there, in here somewhere. Was that a question? I'll fix this, zombie. I promise. But will you? Hey, now we're talking. Cool magnet. Oh, I found a cool magnet. I like it. Uh, what is this? What does this thing do? Water level meter? There seems to be no power. Magnificent! Because I'll have to figure out a way to turn on the power. Well, I have a magnet. Uh, that's not what I wanted. I actually wanted to go out and open the door. God damn it, the buttons of this game. Uh, can I use the magnet to get the thing that is shiny in here? Hopefully the shiny thing is metal. Well, it worked! Oh, who would have thought? It's a metal pipe. Maybe I can find a use for it. Maybe I can stick the metal pipe in this hole and actually grab whatever is in there? They'll save me using my hand. What's this? A fishing line? What kind of fish would catch down here? Can I can I combine items like the fishing line with the, the pipe and then grab this? Ah, I have to interact. Okay, let's make a fishing pole. Nice, all right. I was trying to figure out how to combine the fishing rod with the pipe. And she just wouldn't do it. But as soon as I talked with that thing, she just decided to make one. Uh, did I get it? I got it. Amazing. Now, can I use these cables to fix the powerless thing? Like here. Okay, let's power this ba baby up. I was going to say bed boy. What's that sound? I think the water is going down. Ah! The water is down. We can finally move forward. Zombie, we can move forward. I don't think you can hear me or even follow me. I'll come back for you, zombie. Because apparently you don't move without me. Or like, you don't move at all. What is this? There you are, Mr. Gatekey. Let's get out of here. 
Can I not go through here? Oh, no. I thought I could go through here, but apparently not. This music is way too repetitive and it's just like annoying the shit out of me. Alright, let's use the key. Excuse me, zombie, you're in the way. Zombie, I found the key to the gate. We can get out of here. Zombie? Just go, Lucia. Leave me here. How did I know you were going to say that? Huh? Look, zombie, I don't know what the witch lady did to you, but we can't just give up. There must be a way to change you back. I... I don't know, Luzia. You won't know unless you try, zombie. Well, okay, but the witch is dead. How are we going to change me back? I... I don't know. But we won't know unless we try to find a way, son. Okay, and thanks, Luzia. I know I don't say that as much as I should. It's okay, zombie. Let's get going! I like how animated she is, she's like super... Woo! Okay, let's find someone that can help you. Lucia, I... I don't think it would be good for anyone to see me like this. <laughs> you look fine, zombie. I don't know, Lucia. Ugh. Okay, fine. You stay here and I'll find someone that can help you. Yeah, just stay there, fucking annoying. As if people would care to see like a zombie zombie walking around. Do you get it? Zombie zombie? Yeah. Look at me guys, I am funny. I make fucking jokes. Funny jokes. Fucking jokes. Fucking funny jokes. Mmm, smells delicious. How much for a bowl of noodles? About three a bowl. Would you like some? I wish I had money. Me too. Me too. I sure am hungry. Sorry, little lady. No dough, no noodles. Who are you calling little? You look like you're eight years old. Uh, she has a point, I suppose. Well, the other lady was way nicer than you, sir. How about you, sir? Can you help me? Uh, excuse me. Is there someone here who can help my sister? I'm sorry, but I'm really busy with this mess. Like, fuck your sister. Nobody cares. Well, uh... Well, are your parents home? Maybe I can ask them. Parents? Where are they? You gotta be kidding me! You don't know what parents are? No, sorry. You may have more luck asking someone else. What the fuck? People don't know what a parent is? Hello? Excuse me? Are the parents home? I cannot even interact with this door. Cool. Let's go down here. That's a weird ass town. Can I go in this house? Nope. Can I go up here? I can. For which purpose? None. Amazing. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, it's an alley. Holy Christ. I like it. Interesting. Okay, let's go this way. Hello, sir. I just invaded your kitchen. I hope you don't mind. Hi. Hi. Hey, hi. Ah. Excuse me. Could you help me and my sister out? Actually, maybe you could help me out. I'm starving, but this bozo won't sell me any more fried fish. If you eat any more, you put me out of business. How can a little boy eat so much fish? Easy! Give me one and I'll show you. Nice try. How about you eat some fruit for once? You know, I could eat an apple right now, right about now. Find me an apple, and I'll help you and your friend out. Ugh, fine. But if you don't help us, 
I'll make you choke on the apple. I can imagine her being like, mm, I am angry with you, mister, just because you can, you're making me look for a freaking apple. Sir, do you have a... Ah, uh, excuse me, is this... I hope this is tomato juice and not what I'm thinking. Excuse me, is there someone here who can help my sister? Oh, I see apples from there, from here. What's wrong with your sister? I think she's sick. Oh gosh, that's not good. What kind of sickness does she have? The zombie sickness. I don't know. Something that makes you white with really long arms. That, that sounds more like a curse to me. A curse? Yeah. You didn't meet a witch here by any chance. Maybe? Hmm. Look, I can't help you, but I know someone who can. Hmm, I'm listening. You need to find a noodle lady. Noodle lady? Yeah. She's like an expert on curses and stuff. So where do I find her? Find her. She's usually at the laundromat, washing her underwear. There's a laundromat here? I so need to watch my undies too. Like, whoa, you won't even believe me how gross everything is down there. No offense, but you smell like you need a wash in general. It's probably because you're hanging out with the trash. It's not like I went swimming in a sewer or anything. Do you like hanging out here? I live here. Okay, I'll just be going then. Make sure you find a noodle lady. She can help your sister. Okay, I'll find a noodle lady, strange man. You're just weird. Well, lucky for me, I kind of found the apples. They're on the other side. Can I get there? Great. It's locked. Maybe someone here has a key? Well, people here don't even want to talk with you. Oh! The stairs! Fine, fine, fine. I see, I see. I know how to, to do this puzzle. Yes, indeed. I am very smart. My brain is working really fast. See? Ha! That was amazing. Free apples! Huh? A sign? You may only take one per day to keep the witch away. Great. One it is then. But I'm still hungry. Don't worry, Lucia. Sooner or later you'll be able to eat. Let's go this way. Yeah. Back to the weird kid that I gave him a old man voice. <laughs> old men voices. No, I'm so good at giving people old men's voices. Well, my apple? Here! I spit shined it for you. Ew, Lucia! Oh, awesome! Thanks! Gross. Now, your help, please. Here, take this. You can unlock the gate to the laundromat with it. Oh, amazing! Ah, I'm starting to think that the puzzles on these games are not exactly like high tier. It doesn't really matter. What matters the most for me in any game is not like the puzzle capacity or strong enemies or anything like that. The story gets me in every game. I don't need this key anymore. Oh, good for me. It's a laundromat. I could use some clean clothes right about now. You don't even have money. Oh, okay. Uh, this whole... Th can I go in? I can. Oh, look! It's the noodle lady. I've been expecting you. Lucia. And I've been expecting you, old woman. You don't even know who I am, do you? No. No, I don't. But you may remember me. 
Wait a minute. You're the noodle lady from my dream. Oh my. You're all wet and smelly. I'm trying my best, but I don't know if my microphone is going to break with this voice. Why don't you call your sister? And I'll pay for your clothes to be cleaned. Thank you. That's really not... Wait! How do you know that I have a sister? I know a lot about you and your sister, Lucia. And I'm here to help you. But I never asked for your help. Well, I thought the whole time we were looking for her for her to help us. I think you were just about to. You're not another witch, are you? Are you a witch? Are you ready to, I don't know, throw me a spell? Come on, young one. Let's get you out of those wet clothes. Well, blah, 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 where? I can't just stand here naked. I wouldn't worry about that. There's only one other person who uses this laundromat. And she only comes on Tuesdays. And what day is today? Oh, I'm sitting naked. And my sister as well. So tell me, girls. What do you think about the weather we're having? Oh, lovely conversation. Wonderful, isn't it? Well, actually, not that good. <laughs> actually, it's a bit cold. Actually, it's a bit hot. Oh, it's a blue hair lady person. And she went away after seeing me naked. Huh. Must be Tuesday. <laughs> going to get me the way that it did <laughs> but it did <laughs> you're saying you both were kidnapped yes and they beat zombie up too she has gone too far this time uh who has well it's about time i introduce myself yes it is it's like very past the time I am Yokuna Kagami. But everyone just calls me Noodle Lady. Don't tell me that Yokuna Kagami means Noodle Lady, just like Nikuya actually means Butcher. Why? You don't sell noodles, do you? I mixed up the voices here, oh my god. I own the noodle joint a few doors over. Oh, I see you both have met my daughter, Ashina. The witch is your daughter? That means you can help Zombie! Right? I'm afraid I can't do that, Lucia. So you mean I'm stuck like this forever? My dear, I'm afraid that you're also not alive anymore. I... I'm dead? How? She's standing right there. Sambria, place your hand over your heart. Do you feel a beat? I don't. What happened to me? By the looks of things, you're now a yokai, Sambria. Ooh, she's a yokai. What's a yokai? A ghost. Or a demon? Well, not like a poter guys. You guys have no idea what poter guys is, do you? My daughter must have wanted something from you, Sombria. She she wanted to swap bodies. The strange thing is, why do you still have the same body? You call this the same body? I look like a hideous creature. No, just to pay a woman with really long arms. I've been telling her that the whole time. <laughs> I love the sassiness of this girl. You look fine, zombie. Where is Ashina now? I think she's dead. Her head was floating in the bath. Just went like, boom! 
Did you see what killed her? Actually... No. The lights went out. Then this is good news. Good news? We may be able to reverse the curse. Oh, how? Lucia, didn't you say her head was floating in the bath? You need to retrieve it from for Sambria. Um, how about no? I never want to set foot back in that place again. Don't you want to help your sister? I do, I just... I'll go. Wait, zombie! You've done enough, Sambria, uh, Lucia. Now it's my turn. Will I play as zombie? I love it when sisters get along. Don't you? Yeah, whoopee. Well, what are you waiting for? Huh? Go after her. Why? She obviously doesn't want my help. They never do. So I'll wait for an invitation. You're right. I've probably pissed her off way too much today. Here, take this. It's the key to the bathhouse. Thank you. Thanks, Noodle Lady. It was very nice of you, Noodle Lady. Good luck, little one. I was actually expecting her to have like red eyes or something, but no, she did not. Okay. I think I know where to go. I thought I knew where to go, but then I saw my sister there. How did my sister go there? Oh, there she is. Uh, I cannot talk to my sister, but no worries. I can open the door. I don't really want to go back in there. But I need to help zombie. We should look around here for answers first. Oh, you mean the key that the old lady just gave me? Lucia, why are you here? I said I'll do this on my own. Well, I figure you might need the key to get in. <laughs> well, we ain't gonna find witch's head standing here. Hey, thanks, little sis. Oh, it was adorable. Of blood and water. Why didn't this happen to her? She deserves this more than I do. Hmm? The question is, who said that? Oh my gosh! What the hell happened here? We were literally gone for a day, and now this? Who did this? I... I don't know. But I have a feeling we're going to find out. That's the most cliche sentence I've ever heard in my life. So, where's the head? I think it's in the secret bathroom. I'll go first and find out what's going on. Okay, I'll meet you there. Be careful. How does she float like that? So cool! <laughs> Indeed, so cool. But we're going to figure that out on the next episode. Oh my god, I love the story of this game. The weird thing is that there's all, the only one thing that I want to say before I finish the episode is when I'm doing the voices for the characters, for me, it sounds like they are pretty different and you can like, okay, I know wh when who's talking without seeing the colors. But when I edit this and I'll hear my own voice talking, I'll be like, the fucking difference did that made? Because for me, it doesn't sound different at all. <laughs> but I love it so much. I love it. It was one of my dreams drop jobs to be a voice actress. Never happened. Anyway, hope you guys are enjoying this episode. Hope you all have a happy ever.
I hope you all have a happy ever after. That was hard to come out. And I'll see you on the next tale. Bye bye. Thank you.